Hello, uh, here a quick overview of uh, the upgrade I'm working on for the, our projects.blender.org site. So here you can see our old site uh, based on GeForce and um, it has been in use now since many years and uh, one of the problems is that um, due to performance issues we had to um, close down much of of the site so uh, everything is behind login and it's really hard for users to find uh, anything about bugs or or things like that so I've been working on the upgrade to uh, a newer version of GeForce uh, Fusion Force 5.0.1 and I've been working on a, a different uh, theme as well for this, so it integrates better into our current set of websites. So, this is the current new uh, homepage for the site. Mm. As you can see, it has pretty much the same uh, color palette for the site, and. Um, this is still a test project because I have to uh, fix some things for our site a database upgrade and, and uh, theme fixes and, and other stuff like that but uh, this is just uh, two projects I've put in the front page and uh, added some tags to our official release project and here's some old information. This is just uh, done with a, a dump of the database from uh, I think two or three days ago. The nice thing is that uh, we get performance back and at least right now it looks like we can have everything open. Um, that is sensible to have open so the bug trackers and viewing of our repository through the website so here a huge amount of committers and here we go so this has been out of business for one and a half year and it will be back soon Apparently in Firefox some um, issues still with uh, images, I'll be working on that. But the main point is that we have now this uh, repository browsing back. Uh, another thing is that I am still not logged in, so it's very interesting to see how this works. Um, I'm now already browsing our Blender project and we have search back so if I for instance search for any collateral related issues then here we have them so it has also been out of order for about two years due to performance issues uh, actually the uh, database is one of the problems here and it gets fixed nicely by both upgrade and some cleaning action by me. So that was a search. <coughs> some new things is uh, relations. We can with the new version uh, make relations between bugs. Uh, so like tell if it's um, a duplicate of some bug or or related to some bug is possible to do here. So I was in a testing report for which I had made a fun relation and this one can be seen also as backward relation. That is related to this issue. Apart from being able to link uh, inside the same tracker you can link between trackers and between projects. So uh, 
you can see here that this is actually the Blender extensions project that has been linked to the issue in our Blender 2.xpf, the 2.5 bug tracker, which is pretty cool. I hope we can utilize this new ab ability to manage our bugs much better. Some other small things um, here activity view just to see what has been uh, going on in uh, in the new projects blender.org site uh, so this remember this is just on a, an old an old uh, database dump and here you see this one testing test report another bug that has backward relations to some report they are not real relations, they were just for testing but you can see here we can even set multiple relations for a bug so um, another thing I think is that we can, if you know the bug number for a specific bug you want to find in our in the uh, specific bug tracker you just type in the na uh, the number of the bug tracker and you will be automatically directed to that bug which is also pretty cool so just one more thing is to log in let's log in So as the new personal page with a, a nice overview of issues assigned to you. Uh, if there are tasks assigned, then you will be able to see them as well. Uh, issues you have uh, submitted. So this this testing one we just saw, and a new one is the trackers dashboard. So for all the projects you are a member of, you can see all the issues that are still open. So that's quite a, a bit as you can see. And because I'm on many projects I will be seeing a many issues here. Uh, still some uh, style issues I have to fix but otherwise this is uh, much better than our older project splendor org site. Um, some other fun stuff that will be available is um, when logged in simple graphs um, the activity we already checked out and just nice interesting new features and just much more workable like a, a way to see what is happening in the in the repository that many commits and that many ads so this is uh, what I hope to have available for the public in not too like much time working hard and I hope you will all enjoy it when it's finally online soon thanks for watching